you keep that chip on your shoulder and you go back to zero every freaking day of your life. Now I want you to think about something, okay? I said keep that chip. What's that mean? I got a chip on my shoulder where every single day I'm trying to prove to my wife, my kids, my team, God, everybody in the world, and myself who I am, what I can do, and there's no lids on my life, no limits, and I'm going to the next level, baby, and I ain't never going backwards. Can you imagine that, doing it every day? What? You're saying I can't do it anymore for two weeks and then quit? Most of you in here, you're quitters. You know why you're never gonna fucking make it? It's because you quit. You fucking quit. I don't even need to beat you. You fucking beat you. You beat yourself. Nobody's ruining your life. Nobody's self-sabotaging you. Nobody's fucking you up. The market is dying to pay you. You're fucking weak. All I want to do every day is become a better human being. All I want to do is, is teach other people to become better people. I want to teach them not to lie. I want to teach them to, to tell the truth and to do the right thing. Now I need you to understand this, okay? Nobody's perfect in this world. Everybody's going to lie at some point. Everybody's going to make a mistake at some point. My, my goal with you and, and with myself is from this point forward in our life. I want us to make a commitment together and this is how we're going to crush everybody. You ready? Number one, we're going to keep our word. Okay? We're going to keep our word. That means what we say we're going to do, we're going to do. You got things going on in your life right now that need to be fixed. Am I right? Yes, sir. Whose fault is it? Mine. That's right. Most of you in here right now, you want to blame someone else for everything going wrong. You're the problem. Are you guys ready to really learn how to be a great leader now? Yeah. Most people f***ing don't. Most people don't feel like f***ing participating or growing or changing or, or being aware or being present. You see the problem? Hey, and I'm not a dick. I want that guy to change. But somebody needs to hold his f***ing ass accountable. Does that make sense? Yeah. You know what I do as a leader? I hold myself accountable and I hold other people accountable. And if people don't like you, f them. Listen, you guys got to call your shots. Because look, if you go into a fight and you think you're going to lose, you're going to lose. Am I right? If you go into a fight and you think you're going to lose, you're going to get knocked out. Yes. You can never doubt yourself. Never. How many of you right now, guess what, are a little bit comfortable? Okay? Burn that. Burn that. Guys, I want to say this. Stay starving. Not stay hungry. Stay starving. Guys, how do you stay starving? Well, you got to have something in front of you that you're chasing. Listen, I have a vision of who I want to be in front of me at all times. And I take inventory of that daily. And I wonder, is, am I becoming that guy? Or did I stall out? Right? Like, am I in neutral right now? Or am I in fifth gear? Or some of you are in reverse. Don't be a crowd pleaser. Everybody listen to me. Don't be a fucking ass kisser. Live a life that counts and call your own shot. I need everybody in this room today to write down a fucking dream that they want. Guess what? You don't have a big fucking dream? I'm going to beat your fucking ass. I'm going to smoke you. You know why? Because you're going to hit your little baby bitch fucking dream and then you're going to quit working. And you're going to run around and talk shit like you fucking made it. Now you're going to be the next influencer telling everybody how you fucking won. No fucking way. You're going to create a big dream and then there's another big dream after that one and then there's another motherfucking mountain and then there's another motherfucking mountain and then we'll fucking die one day that's the life